What is up, everybody? Welcome back to another episode of Offered Outlaws. And as you can tell, my game is, uh, well, I have like no money and no gold. I actually went and spent three bucks uh, just to get 100 gold so I can go ahead and unlock the desert so that I can do this video for you guys on showing you guys where all the barn finds are, how to get them, how to unlock them, how to, you know, get each and every one of them. Now, the first one that you have to start out with is the Hemi Kuda, which you can find on the desert. Now, starting out the game, obviously, you either have to spend a little bit of money on gold uh, for the game, or you can grind it out like crazy, completing trails to get the XP up, because you need like 150 or 175 XP to unlock the desert. Uh, and then once you come out here to the desert, I'm pretty sure I'm, I'm going to be grabbing all these boxes uh, for now so that I have money. Irk. Give me that. Thank you. Uh, the first one, the CUDA, I believe. Actually, I have to go look. Is that bad? Actually, I have to go look for the CUDA. But I'll, I'll find it in a second. Let you guys know. Okay, okay. I went and looked at my old video, actually, because I know the CUDA location hasn't changed since then. It's right around in this area. So we're going to drive out there. All right, guys, we're almost to the location of the Hemikuda, which is the first field find you'll find, as you can see on the map. It's just right around here, around this corner, and I should probably undo this. After this, I'll probably actually uh, go upgrade this car a little bit, or my truck, or maybe I'll just drive the car. I don't know. But as you can see, it's right here on the map, or right here. Himikuda, location discovered. Irk. Oh, what I'm going to do. This is going to be thumbnail number one. <laughs> well, I guess part, partial thumbnail. I'm going to splice these all together like I did last time. But the Himikuda location right here on the map. As you can see, we are right here. Click it. You get it. And then uh, all you have to do, go back out. This is the very important part that a lot of people seem to think is like a suggestion and not an actual like fact. You have to build the CUDA before you go on and find the El Camino. And then, of course, you have to find, build the El Camino before you can build the... Uh, I'm going to say it's the Mustang that comes next. Uh, but as you can see, it's over here. You can spend either 500 gold on it, or you can find the parts in boxes like this. And so for the first, obviously, I don't have 500 gold right now. So I'm going to show you guys the easiest way it is to find parts. And the easiest way to find parts is to go back out to the desert and find the big boxes. Now, these are the, it's the same way I make my money. You know, you find these boxes. The only difference is these boxes now have parts in them instead of gold. Now finding the boxes is just as difficult as finding a gold box. As in they're not always going to spawn. There's usually a couple that spawn around the starting location. You just have to reload into the game a few different times before they'll actually show up because all the box spawns are random. As far as I can tell, as far as I've found, they seem to have not added the uh, boxes back into woodlands uh, otherwise I would just say start woodlands up drive drive over to the creek and boom look across there's usually a box there but from what I can tell that's not really a thing so I'm gonna try to go find some boxes guys I'm not gonna bore you guys fully with it I'll go find some boxes all right guys finally found a couple boxes after driving around on the map uh, I know a lot of people like to ask for these locations, even though they're they're pretty random. Like, they spawn in these same locations all the time, but it's random as fuck. Uh, I know a lot of people like to ask for the locations of these, so it's right there on the map. Even though they don't, for sure, always spawn right, hit, right there. This one contained the front axle for the truck, and as well, we have a gold box over here. Uh... It's the little shorter ones, so you know those still give you gold and money when you're not uh, when you're not looking for parts. So we'll continue on and uh, try to find some more parts. 
I love when this happens, okay? I literally spawn in and boom, there's a part box right behind me. Like this is why I tell people just go into the desert, drive around, look for a box. If you don't find any boxes, leave the desert, come right back in because you might just find a box just like this one, which, which contains my wheel parts. Okay. So I want to stress to you guys, this is not a quick process at all. Like I've been, I've been doing this video, making this video for like an hour already. <laughs> We've got like maybe 10 minutes of footage, if that, uh, that's like for this, uh, because you know, obviously I don't want to just go buy a bunch of gold so that I can unlock them all. I want to actually show you guys process and shit, how to like actually Un get your parts for each one of the barn finds and everything like that. But hopefully soon I'll either get enough gold from finding gold boxes or, uh, you know, actually find some more parts. Either one works. Alright, so <laughs> finally got enough gold. As you can see, I got 500 gold up there. Going to go ahead and fix up the Hemikuda. There we go. Got a nice little Hemikuda. Now... We can go and find the, uh, I believe it's the El Camino that is next, yes? Yeah, it's the El Camino. Don't mind the fact that that still says only like 18 minutes. Like, that's crazy. Uh, I actually had to restart the game because that timer stuck at like 12. Um, and the El Camino is in the woodlands, and I actually need to shout somebody out for recording the location of this. I just have to go on here. Um go to my messages on my Facebook page. So if I remember, yeah, that's where I sent it at. I sent it to Facebook. Doo -doo -doo. But it's in Woodlands and uh, I'll look at where it's at. Okay, so shout out to Ethan McDonald for the location of the El Camino. He sent me a video to uh, Facebook. I'm going to go ahead and start driving out that way. It's it's back this way somewhere. I'll show you guys an actual location soon. It's somewhere this way. He found it without the map. Uh, so, you know, huge shout out to him for that. Like, we actually have the map now, so we can actually show a location uh, for people. So I'm going to go ahead and drive down here a little bit, find it, and let you guys know. All right, guys. So we're here at the uh, pretty much location of the the El Camino as you can see right there and on the map we are right here on the other side of the uh, mountain kinda right at it I'm gonna get me a little flick shot here take a little thumbnail or you know another screenshot for a thumbnail and we'll uh, get it fixed up and get on to the next location alright so now that we're back in the garage obviously we have to find the more parts You'll go find the parts the same as the few that I showed you guys earlier out in the desert, or you will can, you know, search, get gold, get enough gold to do it like I did. And that's pretty much what I'm going to do. I'm going to go spend some more time finding some more gold, and then we're going to make our, uh, make our next one. Woo, okay, so after about an hour of grinding, trying to find boxes for gold and or parts, I ended up with, like, missing, like, three parts. Got, finally got those three parts. And, uh, yeah, we can actually go build up our El Camino and then move on to the Mustang. Finally. And then we can obviously just straight away build the Mustang, because I have, like, 700 gold right now. Uh, like, see, I got 700 gold, built the El Camino, and, uh, it's time to go get the Mustang. I'm gonna go over here and repair, thank you very much. And the Mustang is... Obviously, it's on the desert map, so we're going back out to the desert again to go find it. There you go. So the Mustang is up right around in this area up here. So I'm going to drive up there and show you guys that it's obviously there. All right, guys. As you can see, we're right over here, and the Mustang is right up there on that cliff. Kind of hard to tell, but you can tell it's there. So we're going to go get our way up here, and I'm going to show you guys the, honestly, probably the easiest way to climb up this is going to be over here. Just come over here, give it a little gas, right up in the crevice there, and you're good to go. Come over these rocks. Go ahead and repair my truck. 
This is number three in the line of cars. And like I said before, you do have to, you know, oh God, where'd it go? Oops. Room. Okay, where'd it go? Was it down one or was it up more? Yeah, it's up more. <laughs> I always forget that, like exactly where it's at when I'm driving up here. Uh, but of course, you once you grab this, you have to actually go build it and then you can go find the others. Honestly, I feel like they did changes to the way these look as well. Uh, Cause it actually, I don't know. I feel like it looks better than it used to. Oh no. Okay. I didn't get screenshot from that. That's going to be a shitty looking thumbnail for that one. Anyways, we'll go back and go fix that up. All right. We got the Mustang sitting right here and we're just going to go straight ahead and buy our 500 gold. And now we can go get the Nova, and then we can go get the Camaro. Um, obviously, still have to build up them, so it'll take me still a little bit of time to get back up to 500 gold. But the Nova location is obviously in the woodlands, and it's in the bottom left or right-hand corner. I'll show you guys once we get in there. All right, guys, I can see the car. It looks like to be right there, and uh, yeah. It's the bottom right hand corner of the map. You can find the Chevy Nova. Boom. All right, I'm come park on it real quick. Get a good thumbnail from that. Come on, Ooh, there we go. There we go. Of course, we'll have to go build the Nova before we can find the final car, which is the Camaro in the desert. Sheesh, I did it again before I actually took a real screen job. That's okay. But now that we have the Nova built, I'll show again exactly where at on the map it is, right here in the lower right-hand corner. Just drive there, you'll find it. Easy as hell. Now we'll go build that one up, go find the Camaro, and this video will finally be done. Four hours later of grinding and touring. <laughs> oh man. After a long time. Hold on. Let me head pause pole cat. <laughs> After about six hours of grinding, guys, I've finally gotten everything I need to be able to finish this video out. I've gotten all the parts for the Nova. We're gonna go grab the the Camaro and build it real quick because I've got the gold for it and we're gonna be done with this video finally it's been a long time coming for this video but i know you guys do appreciate me taking the time to actually find all the vehicles for you guys and actually make these videos i know you guys love it so make sure you smash that like button if you, these videos actually helped you guys and obviously it, it should uh the camaro is in the desert it's a pretty easy location actually so we're gonna go get that all right guys so the camaro's pretty much right around there uh, so we're going to just drive on over there and show you guys pretty much the uh, easiest way to get there, I guess. <laughs> As we're bouncing around out here. This video has taken so long to make, but I mean, I already said that, like, not even a minute ago. But yeah, definitely uh, takes a while to make these videos, a lot of time grinding. And, you know, even though it's only 20, probably 20 minutes, something like that. Definitely a good video oh, for version 3.6.2. Uh, it's point two with the, uh, you know, added two updates that they did to fix a few bugs. So that's why I always like to uh, click that button, you know, or click that update button, you know, and check for bug fix updates when I know there's bugs to be fixed. It's just right down here. It's actually around that bend. It's where the Camaro is, our final, fifth and final barn find. Um, I don't know about any new barn finds yet. Nobody has confirmed finding a new one, neither, nor has the uh, Offered Outlaws creators confirmed anything about a new barn find yet. So I don't think we have one, but of course that could change and somebody actually find one later on down the road, or maybe we find one. Uh, I would look on Woodlands honestly, but I'm pretty sure there is none because we didn't find any uh, being on, you know, an account that had all the barn finds already. We did not find one there, so I don't think there is. 
Kirk. All right, free camera. There we go. We'll get another good thumbnail here. Try to get a good one. There we go. There we go for that. And the location, obviously, exactly exact point is right there on the map, guys. Grab that, go back to our garage and build the final barn find. All right, here we go, guys. For the fifth and final barn find, over to it, click it. Let me click it, please. There we go. Buy now for 500 gold. Achievement unlocked. Search party. Which apparently is one that uh, must be for completing all of the uh, barn finds. I would assume. Yep, find all field finds. So technically, I guess this, you know, that proves that there's no more barn finds after this. At least not right now in the game. That's pretty cool, though. Got all the barn finds, all the locations for you guys recorded. Hopefully you guys enjoy the video and the time I spent trying to make this video. And I'm going to go and, uh, you know, get my profile back by logging back into profile or back into Facebook so I can have all my uh, other bits of money and all my XP. Really just the XP. So I only got 1200 XP and it's kind of sad. And for those of you wondering about my membership wise, I honestly have not paid for my membership in a while so I couldn't just restore my purchases on buy gold. But when I do my Facebook thing, I should have my membership back. So in case anyone thinks some weird stuff. So thanks for watching. Subscribe if you're new. Comment down below what you think and I'll see you guys in the next one.